Hey guys, what is going on? It is Dennis here and welcome to another video. This is going to be part 2 of the Miracle Circulators, so this is the last part of it. Um, I did more circulators than this, but I figured I'm just going to show this much of it. Um, I spent quite a bit of NX, obviously, and this video is going to be a lot faster because I actually bought packages of circulators. So yeah, uh, a lot of my friends actually told me that they got attack speed plus 1, like in the first pack so I was like okay let's just do this and it became a struggle so um, yeah I'll just let the video play through and let's just talk about some other things now over the weekend I watched uh, well for the first time I watched anime and it's been a very long time since I've watched anime I think it was like the last time was probably during high school so yeah I really missed anime and the thing about my life and how busy I've been I always say that is like you know I, I don't really have time to enjoy the flowers if you want to use that analogy like I don't have time to really sit back relax and just enjoy life so it's it's been a very long time but I kicked back and I watched uh, Sword Art Online and I don't know like the, the after I finished watching the whole thing like the whole season one it just like it gave me like a feeling of happiness I'm, I'm not really sure how to describe it fully but I was just like really happy after I watched it because you know if, if you uh, well most of us here are gamers if you're watching my YouTube channel it's probably because you play Maple Story but you know most of us we play Maple Story and um, well spoiler alert I guess for Sword Art Online if you didn't watch it yet but um, you know it's it's kind of like a fantasy you know if if I remember when I was in high school thinking about gaming it was kind of like a fantasy to just go to high school with my other online friends, you know, that kind of thing. And near the final episodes of Sword Art Online, they did end up going to the same school together, like everybody. So it's just like, it was just so cool, you know, that kind of thing. So it was almost like I was reliving my childhood dreams. So yeah, that's Sword Art Online. And also just the just the um, romance inside. Well, it, I mean, it, it turned out to be a drama, which I didn't expect. And it, the whole entire thing, I was just like... I was pretty happy about it just watching it and it was just really fun and I just liked the innocence of it all because it's just like you know they were pretty innocent they're just like well I think Kirito is 16 and Asuna was like 17 and yeah I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing those names wrong I'm not that good at pronouncing names but yeah it was just like fun that's just all I can describe it as and I know like I wrote on Basil Market about Sword Art Online and there's some people that were pretty critical on it and, you know, I'm not trying to say, like, Sword Art Online is one of the best animes. It's actually the only one I've watched in several years. But what I'm trying to say is, you know, it's it was fun. You know, that's, I feel like that's the main point. And I just had so much fun watching it. So if you guys haven't watched uh, Sword Art Online yet, I highly recommend it. And sorry for the little spoiler that I just said about the last few episodes. But yeah, it's, it's such an awesome anime. And the thing that I liked about it is, you know, I was expecting a lot of cliches because I haven't watched anime in so many years. So I was just like watching this part and like watching one part or another part and I was just thinking, okay, this is probably going to happen, then afterwards this will happen. But then like SAO took it a completely different direction than what I expected and that's what I liked about it, you know, it didn't follow all the cliches that I expected it to follow, and a lot of the things were um, unexpected, so I guess spoiler alert again for SEO. Um, the first 15 episodes, I, I really did not expect them to actually finish the game in the first 15 episodes, and then the last 10 episodes, a lot of people were really critical on the last 10 episodes, because they felt like it was completely just filler and I, I do understand and like the other people's viewpoints but I also appreciate the last 10 episodes because it showed um, like there are a lot of things in SAO that just you know they did they mentioned something like they mentioned the cousin early on and or his sister his cousin and later on they actually show you who the cousin is and like it elaborates on everything so for the most part there weren't that many um, plot holes I felt like there were a few things that were a little bit strange about SEO because, you know, I am a gamer myself and I'm trying to think about this in a different perspective. For example, like, I think it was like episode, I'm not sure what episode it was, it was early on, I think it was like episode 3 or 4 
when they called him the Black Swordsman. Um, they go to that one field, get the flower that you can use to heal your dead pet or something. And I was just thinking in my head, okay, if it's such a rare item and it's just sitting over there, why couldn't the bandits or the other people that were trying to steal it, why couldn't they just go and pick the flower themselves? So it was just like that kind of thing. It was a little bit weird. And also, uh, one of the scenes where um, they first kiss, um, Kirito gets his left hand chopped off, and it, he, he gets his left hand chopped off, and it's kind of weird, because they kiss, and he's using his other hand to hold her as he's kissing her, then the scene right after that, he's just drinking tea, and he's got both of his hands again, and I'm just wondering, like, what the hell, what was the point of chopping his hand off if he's just gonna get it back, so... I don't know, but all in all, it was an excellent anime, and I just had so much fun watching it, so yeah, I just wanted to talk about that a little bit with you guys. And uh, yeah, so talking about the Miracle Circulators, I really don't think I'm going to do any more of these, simply because the NX ratio is so high. So the last potential I ended up with ended up with was um, item drop rate 20% and if you saw earlier on in this video I already got that once so this is the second time I'm getting it but um, I decided yeah whatever we'll just get it anyways and um, yeah it's it'll help me out I guess in bossing in Evolution Empress if I want to get more shoulders so yeah I figured uh, I wouldn't do any I won't do any more of these until the next time they are on discount or the next time when annex ratio is a lot lower so yeah um anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video and leave your opinions of sword art online in the description or in the comment below in the comment section blah okay yeah see you guys later